All right, simple tutorial on the uh, on the wall glitch. I, I mean, I look like one person said they wanted a video. I can make a simple video on that. I was about ready to do it anyways. Getting tired of catching some freaking fish. It's so annoying sometimes, especially when you lose your rhythm on it. Now, on this one, simple as this. Just, you know, make sure you got your, you know, the guns you want to use equipped. And I don't rec recommend using the, um, I, I really recommend the uh, bolt action because, or the spring filled. Just, yeah, I'm going to use a spring filled because it's so clean and not dirty. But anyways, um, bolt action is probably better, fast, faster firing rate, but I also want to try a glitch with it. I don't know if it's going to work, but anyways, so wall breach method make sure you have the lint give your you know i always do this first make sure i have my lantern out and then uh yeah i can just shoot these guys and get the cops on me all right so we got a one we got everybody coming now we already know the house is up here it's simple you just go up to this house you got the you got the witness you got the murder you're not going far enough away to lose it so that's the cool part so you you can't you can't fuck it up this way and who wants to spend freaking two dollars trying this over and over again oh i must have just reset five minutes got some xp for that anyway so i'm gonna get my pistol i'm gonna get my pistol already out so simple as this now i mean i fail this a lot so it's as simple as this it's just look straight down and it's so, you literally just it's this. So it's like not right against the wall. Just put half your lantern in the wall. This is going to be Patch Tuesday, but it's pretty much have your lantern not 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 to the point where you can't walk forward, but you can. It's, it's, ah, and I lost the cops. God damn it! I'm trying to explain it. I'm trying to get the position right. I could have just. I would have been better off just randomly trying it to be real, but. Now I go back and get the cops on me, and so that's that's very because you get inside the building and like yeah I got inside the oh my god I got no cops on me yeah it's gonna be a problem when you're trying to make this uh trying to make this XP work so no point in getting in the freaking wall breach unless I got cops on me I usually I forgot because I usually go over here. It says crime reported. I usually do this. I go up here, it says witness assault, and I forgot because right before I do the wall breach, I usually get off my horse and run towards the door, and I get my my lantern should already be equipped. I mean, I have my gun equipped, and then what I usually do is this: I I shoot, and then I go inside the wall breach and just. Just as simple as this, like, see, I messed up. It's not as easy as everybody says it is. But if you get good at it, it is. And as soon as you do that, see how I did it? I hit the, I hit right when I was walking towards it, I would hit the, uh, hit the method. You got to play with it because it's really hard to tell you the exact timing because it's within milliseconds. It's very hard to fucking figure that shit out. I ain't gonna lie. I mean, it's, it's just you gotta play with it. You'll get the timing right completely and you just know it. You know, you know, you walk right there, boom, it's super easy. But even the best of everybody can fuck it up. Even I can fuck it up. Now, we're on the wall breach. Now, this is another thing that you, I mean, I recommend you do. Use, use special rounds for real, but. This is a this is something that a lot of people don't realize. I can switch. I mean, this one I, I you know I had the other one was dirty, but you can have this set on here, and then you can have this set on you know have it set on whatever you got you know. But watch, I'm gonna show you a little trick here. You don't want to sit there fucking reloading for five minutes and you're trying to go cops, and then on top of that, you know. There's a there's gonna be this delay when you're doing this shit solo. So why not let a few get close over here and do the eyes wide shut and get some extra XP? I mean if you do that a thousand times, that's a lot of XP. 
I'm just, it's just my point of view. I mean, it's, and you got auto target, so, uh, well, not there, obviously, but you, um, yeah, yeah, I mean, this is going to be patched. Rockstar doesn't like the wall breach methods. They don't like it at all. But, uh, yeah, when they get right here, I should have just showed you. You can auto target on them, get the, get the, get the lock on, and, um, um, yada, yada, yada. I want to hear you fucking die. Yeah, I'm in the passive glitch. So I've, I've been stuck in it since I did the last video. <laughs> but, yeah. Um, look at that. That's, look at those potential freaking money right there. Boom. That is 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30. Boom, easy 30, no matter what you do. Like, actually, it's, you know, if they're on their horse. That's the thing. If you can, if you just, you're just lazy and you don't have to do anything else, but you get in a reward with the uh, other thing. If you're doing the award stacking, all you got to do to do the award stacking is there's two methods. I recommend not dying when you kill yourself, like, or disconnect the internet. Do not die because it saves server, it saves locally now. And you'll sometimes get all your shit get, get stuck. So if you want to do a word stacking method, do not, for the love of God, get killed after you disconnect the internet. It still saves, you know, your side. And it lets the rock star know that you died. Unless you want to delete your save data and do a whole bunch of bullshit and wait longer. Yeah, you go for it. But it's, yeah, it, it it usually worked. I would have recommended it, but now that I found out that it doesn't work so well, then yeah, it's a possibility for a fucking out. And then not only that, look at this, going first person. First person's way better. Don't don't cheat yourself. First person. When you're doing this method, first person makes the shit. A lot better. Hey, so first person key thing too. First person on this method. There you go. Then um, I'm trying to remember, I'm trying to think. I might have forgot something. I probably did. If I did forget something, I'm gonna leave it in the comment selection. <sighs> Anyways, so this is how you do it. And then crimes. You get you can stack the methods. Now, oh wait, that's another thing. Like, disconnecting your internet. Like, if you die, dying causes a save. I, I mean, it does cause a server side. And I guess I never hit the save point. But I did recently. So, you can actually get saved when you died after I disconnected my internet. Like, I literally would just, like, go outside. Like, like, like I would just click, disconnect the internet, and die. I disconnected my internet. This is what happened. So, it's like three... Four, five, six, seven. Turn on my internet. I mean, I put a switch on this shit because I'm so fucking tired of disconnecting my internet. I mean, it's not even a lag switch. It's just like a a switch to disconnect my internet. You get the air code. That's what you need to keep the uh, solo state. And this is what happens when Rockstar fucking glitches out. And this is when you really kind of want to quit the app and restart. Because you never know when you get that blue screen. And the blue screens happen when you get this freaking screen. So avoid this screen at all costs if you can. I mean, yeah, I've, I've, had it, I've had it last and not give me problems for quite a while. So, I mean, on top of that, the benefit, the other benefit of doing the, uh, basically unplug the, plug the modem from the router, you know, disconnect the partial internet, you need a device that doesn't notify you you cannot just straight disconnect it from your ps4 because the ps4 automatically detects that it's disconnected and it will automatically due to the fact that it recognizes will disconnect you and remove you from ps4 playstation and that is not going to help you out with any glitches ever most likely you have to re-sign in and, you know, all the yada yada bullshit. So, yeah, don't do that. So, anyways, so you're going to you're gonna pretty much just launch into a lobby like this. And look, I, I literally just disconnected my internet and I still have the glitch. It's everybody's 
super ghosted to me. Don't have I just disconnected my internet for I don't know, you you call it like eight seconds or something. I mean but uh don't die. Dying dying by the cops, stuff like that will cause a save even when you come back online. I don't understand how I lost my I'm other character, not base character, but I lost that. I had a ward stacking. You can award stack a shit ton of fucking goddamn. You can have a, you can have like a list of fucking awards. Like, let's just say like you got like, you only have to spend $1 to get to, you know, 500 fucking dollars spent in trade. You can go, you can um go left on a D-pad and uh, just hold triangle to mute a whole bunch of people that die because that's the only downside of yeah downside of the glitch is you only you only hear everybody when they're dead <laughs> it's just like oh you want to hear a dead guy he died and he didn't hear him but just seriously though simple thing is you just restart your fucking game in a certain manner like cause a network error for your thing you can repeat everything like it seems like it loads faster too. Like going from disconnect internet for four seconds right after I grab a miracle tonic, and I or right while I'm grabbing a miracle tonic because it still fucking saves. Right while I get up and I'm grabbing it, and right when it right when it actually take it, I connect back. And as soon as I get a network error, I just went right back. Boom. I'm milking whatever you're milking, whatever you're trying to like re up on. You got it. It's right there. The Disconnect internet part seems to speed up the reload into a new session. I mean, I do have a solid state drive connected to my stuff, but I really believe that the actual method of you getting disconnected and rejoining kind of speeds up the, uh, speeds up the stuff a little bit, a little bit, like about 10 or 15 seconds. That adds up over time. Anyways, hopefully you guys eh, enjoy um, enjoy the rest of your night. You know, maybe I uh, get me some subscribers. It's up to you. You can subscribe if you want to. You can watch your MTV. Mm -mm -mm. And I better not fucking play some music right now because I'm going to get disabled on actually uploading videos if I start fucking accidentally uploading a video when I want to listen to YouTube videos. <laughs> you guys have a wonderful, wonderful weekend. Hopefully, you guys utilize the methods and, uh, you know, and hopefully Rockstar doesn't ruin the game on Tuesday. We can all pray. I can't wait until that fucking repeater comes out. Peace out.